<laughs> Never looked forward to this in my entire life. I, I remember when David came down the street, we were working the improv, and David, I mean, I was standing outside the improv going, why? What am I doing? On Ninth <laughs> Avenue, you know? And Dave, this was years ago, and David came down the street, and he was just, he was high. He said, I just had the greatest show ever, and I wish every comedian would have that, because he was lying, but he said, I wish every comedian would have that kind of show. And I went to Pips, and they said, improv's too hip. you got to go to Brooklyn, because that's television. When you get ready for television, you got to go to Pips. And I went, and they stared at me. Little Jewish kids looked at me. You know? And then later, years later, when I went back, I hadn't gone there for a while, and I, again, I bombed, and I was up in the bathroom or something, and I hear these kids go, you should have been here last week. Someone was funny. <laughs> oh, no, you overheard that? I overheard that. I don't know. But you know what he said is true. If, you, if When you get that kind of rejection and nothing happens to you, what do you do? It, it toughens you up. You either crumble or you get tough, you know?